almost complete and I think I made a mistake by leaving more juices for the end of the day because I knew I would be hungrier at the end of the day. But now I just have like this really bad headache and I have three juices still to do and to be quite honest with you and to be quite honest with you I feel like puking. That green juice, super green, was disgusting. I drank a little over half of the bottle and I just can't do it anymore. I'm just, I'm gonna puke. And my energy levels are so low. I just feel like fainting and eating pizza. Pizza. <laughs> <laughs> but I think I'm gonna have this one first because it has some sugar. It's called Sun Power. It has pomegranate, pineapple, orange, apple, cucumber. So I'm gonna drink that because I tried eating the beet one, Mother Nature, and I felt like puking even more. I mean, it's sweet for vegetables, but it's not sweet as for like fruit. There's beetroot, cabbage, celery, Swiss chard, carrot, and lemon. And that one. And then I think I'm gonna end the day off with this one. Do good. What I'm excited about is that the first ingredient is honeydew. That's my favorite bubble tea. Honeydew milk bubble tea. So honeydew, spinach, orange, and lemon. So I'm gonna end the day off with that. And then I'm going to use this as my chaser. It's alkaline water. I'm not sure what alkaline means. I guess it's like acidic and basic. Alkaline is good. I'm tired. Okay, so yeah, that's that concludes day one. Hopefully day two goes better. So this is the morning of day two. Your alarm. We woke up before our alarm. I was feeling very sick. The end of day one, I didn't even film the end of day one because I was feeling very, very weak. Even more weak after that last video I took and it's not very nice to say but I vomited and I did not know that that was a side effect because to be honest I didn't do like a ton of research I just wanted to try it like whatever let's do it I always feel like the less research is better sometimes like with movies I don't watch trailers when I got eye, la eye laser surgery I didn't want to know how they did it because then I wouldn't want to do it so obviously I didn't research a ton about juice cleanses. I didn't know that this could be a side effect for people. And they say everybody's different, you know, you could have headaches, weakness, diarrhea, vomiting. And really I only got fatigue and vomiting. So day one went fine actually, but after that green smoothie, mm-mm-mm. I didn't feel well after the green smoothie, but it didn't take until like the evening time until I started feeling nauseous. And then I did a really bad mistake though because I was supposed to have five juices throughout the whole day on day one. And I was so stupid I only did two for like until 6 p.m. Because I thought that I could just squeeze in the last few smoothie or not smoothies juices at the end of the day when i'd be most hungry but then you run into factors of like mixing so i was mixing like a green juice with like a nutty juice with a water with a fruity juice and i think my body just like freaked out <sighs> so then even in the middle of the night i was feeling nauseous there was one point I had to like go onto the ground in fetal position because I was like sweating profusely. 
And then day two, I feel like most people say that they feel better on day two, all energized. I didn't feel that. I still felt fatigue and mm, more nauseous. So I woke up, had a glass of water, threw up the water, and then I felt better. So then I took my first juice of the day because I just, I really, I, I don't and I didn't want to quit. I'm like, let's just do this. So I took the first juice and I took a quarter of it. And then I vomited that. And that's when I realized, well, geez, I don't think I can go into work today. Because <laughs> I can't even hold down water or juice or anything. Like, this sucks. And then I started reading online of what people do. And some people, they said, you know, it's not about quitting, blah, blah. You know, you gave it your all, but your body is just rejecting this. And I don't know why my body's rejecting it so much because, like, I eat pretty healthy. Like, I have a salad a day, I have steel-cut oats every day, and then, like, for dinner I'll have whatever. Sometimes a cheat meal for dinner, like a burger or something, but, like, that's the extent of it. Like, I don't eat that unhealthy. Like, are these toxins in my body that I have to get rid of? Like, my body's just not accepting the nutrients? I don't know. But what I know is that I can't go on like this. Like, not even being able to stomach water? That's like flu-like symptoms. Like, I could go into the hospital, and I don't want to risk that. Like, there's not- there hasn't been proper studies on juice cleansing. To actually have evidence of why it's good for you. Like, they have ideas, whatever, but not like hard, hard facts. So, I feel so bad because I spent like 200 bucks on a three day juice cleanse that has like 18 juices. But I think what I'm going to do is either incorporate one or two of those juices into my daily regimen a day and like have breakfast have dinner and maybe for the lunch i'll have a juice or something like that or i don't know maybe i'll take a break for a day or two and then do a one day cleanse again and see how that goes i don't know we'll play it by ear but all in all this was a very fail juice cleanse and it's like i almost feel like i'm sorry i failed you guys because I don't like quitting. Like, I can push myself, but this is like dangerous territory. Like, I don't want to be hospitalized. <laughs> so, yeah, I lasted one day on a juice cleanse. <laughs> Okay, so technically today is day three of this juice cleanse, but really I'm gonna make it day two. So on the first day, as you saw, I really screwed up and I didn't even drink, I think, two or three of the juices that I was supposed to eat in day one. So what I'm going to do, this is the plan here, okay? Instead of eating like six juices a day and not eating anything, I'm going to customize this so that A, it's sort of a juice cleanse. I'm still getting vitamins, but I'm getting in that fiber. I'm getting in some protein, and it's not damaging to my body. I won't have to go to the hospital. So here's the plan. In the morning, I have a small breakfast. I'm gonna have like an egg or egg whites with some avocado, some grape tomatoes, and I had a few cashews with like two raisins. So that's my breakfast. Lots of nutrients going on, lots of healthy fats that you don't get in a juice cleanse. So start the day off with that. Then during the day, I'll either have two or maybe three juices. And then for dinner, I'm going to have like a very green and veggie type of dinner. So I'm thinking like maybe a, a salad 
with like chickpeas on top or maybe like I can grill up some red peppers and orange peppers and have that on top of the salad or maybe on the side something along the lines of that for dinner so breakfast and dinner will be foods but pretty light and then during the day I'll have two to three juices so that is the new plan for this juice cleanse I can also get rid of all the juices that are in my fridge and it's not a waste of money and I'm still sort of doing a juice cleanse more so a customized juice cleanse So I also just wanted to mention that juice cleanses, it's not that like juices are terrible. I mean, juices are healthy, they're full of vitamins, full of minerals, and all that good stuff. But when you're strictly on a juice only diet, you're not getting the necessary fiber, protein, and all that good stuff in your diet, so your body is freaking out, right? So I don't not believe in juices. I just don't believe in juice cleanses. I think the best juice cleanse to have is when you are doing like three or four juices a day and then you get to eat like a dinner that's like only veggie or like a breakfast that's only vegetables something like that just to get at least some fiber and like chewing action in because otherwise just juice is just you're gonna be hospitalized you know well everyone's different but at least for me you know it just it doesn't work you need food in your system especially after three days okay so now i'm gonna take my first shot I have three of these shots to go through, and this one is called Blood Booster. It looks like they squeezed the blood out of a liver or something. It looks so dark. So what's inside, you may ask? Well, there's chlorophyll, E3 Live, and go to cola. I don't know. This booster is a natural deodorizer. It helps remove toxins from the blood while providing you with an overload of blood enhancing nutrients. Am I supposed to drink this all in one go? Do I shake it? Okay. Ooh, it's green. Dark green. Okay. I'm going to take it this in two shots. Basically tasted like flavorless grass. I feel like a cow now. Mm. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> okay, so technically today is like day four, I guess you could say, but I'm taking all of the juices and I'm spreading them out as far as I can spread them out. I decided to have the beet juice now because this was the one that on day one I tried to eat or drink and this is the one that made me ooh. So I'm gonna have this one. You know, I had one egg with some egg whites this morning, like probably four hours ago. So I pretty much got like an empty stomach right now. Got my trusty water here. I think I'm gonna use my water as a chaser. This really isn't that bad. I would say especially if you start the day off with this, but if you're ending the day off with this, it's just meh. Same with ginger, I feel. I feel like ginger is better in the morning than in the evening. I think as you do a juice cleanse, or if you ju do do juicing, if you do do juicing, <laughs> then you kind of figure out what works for your body and what doesn't, so. The beet 
one, Mother Nature. It's, it's called Mother Nature. It has beetroot, cabbage, celery, Swiss chard, carrot, and lemon. And the reason why I chose this one to have today was because I looked at all the expiry dates of the juices. This one actually expires three days ago. But I mean, it, sh it should be fine. It's just, it's just beets, right? It's just, it's best before three days ago, but it's still fine. And I checked all the labels of all the other drinks and they expire today. So I'm going to try my absolute best for the next two days to finish all of them. I don't know if I can finish the green ones because those ones really make me nauseous, but I'll definitely finish like the fruity ones or like the fruit veggie mixes like this beet one. I'll definitely finish those ones. So I'll have this one. It's, it's noon right now. I had breakfast about three, four hours ago. And I think around three or four o'clock, I'll have another juice. I think the honeydew spinach one, I think I'll have that one later. Or if I can muster a green juice, I'll try. And then I'll have dinner tonight. So that's the plan. Now time for the action. Cheers. Ew, it's already like dripping on me. And beets, you have to be careful because beets stain. It's probably not good that I'm wearing a white shirt. Sorry about my no makeup look. I'm not sure if it just tastes bad or that's rancid. Oh, I just, I hate celery in juices. I don't know what it is. I hate when celery is in any juice. <laughs> Maybe this is expired. Blech. It tastes like there's ginger in there, but I know that there's not. And I just, I taste the celery and it's, literally it's making me tear up. Oh. Juicing is not fun. Anyways, bye. Digestive shot. It's supposed to aid in digestion. Ugh. Tastes like pure lemon. Ugh. It's sweet, at least. Ugh. So I just wanted to show you what I made for dinner tonight, which is the exact same as last night, so you kind of get the idea of how I'm doing this, you know, juice combo with food thing. So here is my dinner for tonight shrimps, fish, and a mix of vegetables. So I got like red peppers, onions, broccoli, garlic, and then I'm just gonna put like some barbecue sauce just like over the vegetables and maybe just a bit of salt. And I put some lemon over the seafood. Okay, so this is technically day five now. Um, I'm going to have my daytime juice. I had one egg and some egg whites and tomatoes this morning because I woke up pretty late this weekend. And I'm gonna have tango. And tango, I already had, it was the first day. And I know it tastes really good, so I'm excited about this one. And now all my juices are going to be like today is going to be one day expired so I'm hoping that today and tomorrow I'll be able to finish some of the, of the juices that I got so this one's pear, grapefruit, pineapple, and orange so fruity so they're easy mm, I like this one cheers have a good day